hello guys welcome back to my channel you're welcome to my youtube space my name is amara if you're seeing me for the first time you're welcome in today's video i want to show you guys how i made this delicious fish stew so i'm using tilapia fish and this are my spices curry powder salt and thyme that's all and i added it to my fish i just want to steam the fish no much cooking and I added onion and seasoning cube. You guys saw when I added the seasoning cube. Then again, I have to stir it, make sure that everything is marrying together before I'll start steaming my fish. You know how soft fish can be. So you don't need to like overcook it. It's not chicken after all. So here I added just a little bit of what I'm going to use to steam the fish. Then I stir it properly, cover it to steam up, okay? So after that, just to steam it for like about two to three minutes, you don't need to cook very well, not cooking, but actually steaming it. Enjoy the video. So here now I have my tomato mix. Here I have green pepper, pepper, red pepper, tomatoes and onion. So I just started blending it because honestly I want to cook it before I will add it to my stew. So I don't have like a sour test um, pepper mix. Blending it. I added it to a pot and I started cooking it. So this is me cooking my tomato mix. Okay. And after that, I checked my fish to see how far it has steamed. And I noticed that it has already started breaking. And I quickly started bringing them out from the pot. You can see that it started, it started breaking. And that's the fish. Honestly, I love using any fish. But this one hits differently. You can use any fish, mackerel, catfish. But this one uh, I, I love I love the test it came out with so after that I started frying my fish look at this golden see how it's, it's golden <laughs> so I just did a very deep frying so after the frying I emptied my pot so this is my pot added a little bit of vegetable oil then with the fish oil that i used to fry my fish okay i added it after all we're making fish too so i don't need to waste my oil so if you don't like it you can skip it but i, I fish you can sieve it out I, I tend not to because i want to be i want to have it with my stew okay so you can actually sieve yours out but i didn't sieve mine so after that i added onion and stir it properly because we need to get the stew down immediately <laughs> you guys know how it be sunday rice always hit differently so if you cook this i know you are going to love it so if you watch it up to this moment and you've not subscribed to my channel please i guess this is just a great opportunity to hit the subscribe button and support me okay let's support this channel to grow all right so after that i have to start adding my my tomato mix because Right there, it has, the sour has already gone and I'm just adding it to mix up with the, the vegetable oil and the onion, okay? So, right there, I just added it and all of them are just marrying each other. Because we already cooked the tomato mix remember just to make sure that everything comes together cook it before adding your meat my fish stock okay so after that I added my meat stock here is my meat my fish stock actually so if you're using meat or fish anyone you're using but this one I use fish so I added my fish stock and gave it a nice stir
so here i covered it to boil and i added crayfish i just added just one spoon of this crayf of crayfish inside because after we're making fish too so i added crayfish you can skip the process of adding crayfish but i added crayfish because it always give it a very beautiful um it, it sends so well and it tastes so well so if you can if you want if you add crayfish in your stew you will enjoy if you don't if you haven't tried it you can skip that process then i added one cube of seasoning cube and salt to taste actually it has started hitting the feel like the smell was everywhere you know how how fish too can be like if you have not tried fish too this is a great opportunity for you to try it because or more I don't even know how to explain it so after that i added scent leaf this is actually a dry scent leaf because to get fresh one here you don't know but have you tried scent leaf in your stew if you have not tried this one scent leaf with stew most especially chicken fish stew if there's any stew if you have not tried try it try it you enjoy every bit of it so i just added my vegetable which is my scent leaf and i cover it to steam very well then voila this is my stew my stew is ready bring your rice okay this is the actual time for us to eat our sunday rice and actually you guys i enjoyed this i enjoyed it and by that time my rice is already ready so i started scooping it out at this junction i want to tell you that my cooking is all done so come and enjoy yourself okay Come and enjoy yourself. Bring your white rice. Fat. Food is radio. Makandi Jego. Please hit the subscribe button and support me. Okay? Support me. My leg day for grand rule. I just did talk I'm now. Thank you very much, guys. And I will see you guys in my next video. 